Okay, just doing some quick testing on the uh, various Tesla components, in particular the charger with um, Damien McGuire's control board on it. This is a version 1 board. You can kind of see the, um, for the eagle eyed, you can see the USB port sticking out the side rather than the top. Um, so what we got here is I've got a, um, an Arduino that's driving a bunch of relays. Those relays are hooked up to the front of the Chevy Spark uh, battery, the A123 battery. They're connected to, there's two high voltage outlets there. There's one for the main drive and then this smaller one is for the charging system. And it has a pre-charger um, uh, incorporated into it. And so you can see there, there's a data plug there which is the enabling signals for the, um, for the contactors and the pre-charger. So that's currently going into um, the high voltage junction box. I've got the AC side hooked up just there, um, but it's currently not powered up. And then the high voltage DC side from the battery comes in here. I've got that hooked up to a voltmeter. Um, and then I've got it jumping across to the Gen 2 charger with um, uh, Damien's control board on it. And then that's um, the serial port there is back to the PC. So on the PC, hopefully, I don't know how well this will come out, but you can see that the, the charger control board is feeding back. It's not seeing any AC or DC at the minute. Um, and then this is the little control sequence for the, um, for the battery for the, to produce power. So what I'm going to do is uh, we're going to enable this and oh, forgot. Forget that. Turn that on first. Okay, now we're going to enable it. There we go. Okay, I don't think we've seen anything down there yet. We shouldn't see anything down there for another second. So if I See the DC voltages have switched on. The, um, the charger has all it has going in right now is uh, plus 12 volts and ground. Uh, there's no CAN connections or anything like that. I think that board is currently running the Gen 1 version 1 software, um, with not the Tom Debris stuff. Um, so one of the plans is to update that and see if I can get any CAN out of it. And uh, to enable charging on the AC side, or from the AC side, I'll need to hook up a mains relay. Um, I've currently got a 5 volt one instead of a 12 volt one, um, but I may just manually connect it to see if I can get that part of the sequence running. Okay.